Hello everyone and welcome back to Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central introductory course. This is lecture 4 of module 5 where we will see how you can enter and edit information in Dynamics 365 Business Central. In previous lecture we have seen how you can navigate between records in a list page in Dynamics 365 Business Central. So let us now understand how you can enter and edit information in Dynamics 365 Business Central. One thing you need to keep in mind is that you cannot edit information directly in a list page so you can only edit information in a card page so let me now show you in our trial instance this is a list of vendors in my dynamics 365 business central so there is no way that you can directly start editing any record from your list page so if you want to edit any information so if you click a particular record then it will open its card page now in the card page you can edit the information as per your need so let me now change city by clicking here you can select the different city you can enter the address for a lookup field you can also add a new value you can also select from a full list if you click here so you can select the zip code or if you want to so if you want to create a new record in the lookup field then you can do it by clicking new entry new button here or from here as well you can also search the city name with the search box you can create a new entry from here you can edit the list in excel you can also create a new record from here as well or you can directly add a new entry from this new button as well so this is how you can enter data in a lookup field so this is how you can enter the data in the card page also you can perform and take certain actions from the command bar in that card page let us now suppose if I want to create a payments journal then click on actions and create a payments journal now you can see the payments journal will be created you can enter whatever the information you want it from here so this is how you can edit information in dynamics 365 business central so you can always edit the information in the card page only so let us now see how you can create new records in dynamics 365 business Central. so you can create new records either from a card page by clicking this plus sign so if you click the plus sign here it is going to create a new vendors so what is the type of vendor you can select it from here you can select one of the type and once you click ok so it is going to open up a blank vendor card and now you can enter so now you can fill up the required information in the fields for this new vendor that you want to create another place from where you can create a new record in the list is by clicking the new button in the command bar of that list so if you click a new button there then also it is going to create a new vendors so you can enter whatever the information that you want so now you can see a new vendor from the list is created here so this is how you you can enter and edit information in dynamics 365 business central and on that note i will wind up this lecture hope to see you all in the next lecture till then bye bye and take care Thank you.